Gigi's. Welcome back to another episode of our Extreme Vampire Legacy Challenge. So, Extreme because we picked the biggest lot in the whole of the place and made it a celebrity lot, so it has the most highest uh, possible bills you can pay. Legacy because we're trying to get to 10 generations, building from absolutely nothing to hopefully a beautiful legacy and a huge home. Vampire because we're doing all that whilst also being spooky vampires. A bit like this song. If you remember the song and your OG, have a little dance now. And ignore the sim music, but yeah, have a little dance now. <laughs> we have our twins. They're almost halfway. They've only got five days left. So they could end up aging up in today's episode. And one thing I'm going to do real quick. We're just going to nip into cats. Oh, I'll them with a vampire. That is... <laughs> That's the song that's Riku's life, isn't it? That's Riku's theme song for his whole life. Okay, um, I just wanted to check their teeth real quick. Yes, so I'm gonna swap out their teeth to my favorite teeth, which is these little guys here. These are the Maho Creations vampire teeth. I just think they look so clean. Like, these ones are very realistic, but in actual game mode live, you kind of want a clean look. I like somewhere in between realistic and somewhere in between magic. Mag Max as much, and this feels like the best solution for me. Is that music a little bit too loud? Let me switch it down a little bit. Let me know. Um, so yeah, I'm switching both the kids to these teeth. They had their first drink in the last episode. So that is why their eyes have changed to red. They're also both evil. We were thinking maybe in the next generation they wouldn't hate uh, humans as much. The music is too loud. It's because it's got lyrics in it as well. Lyrics definitely makes it... Um, Harder to concentrate on me speaking and you guys hearing what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, in the last episode, they did drink their first bloods. So they're definitely... Uh... Oops, what did I just do? Did I take her teeth off? Yeah, she's got the same teeth. She's got the adult version as well, which is here. Maho Creations. If you're on Twitch, I have linked them in the chat. If not, if you just type in Maho Creations, you have to download a, a one for toddlers, one for children. And also one for um, children as well. So there we go. Okay, you guys are saying the music's quite loud with um, the vocals as well. So I'm just going to switch back to a uh, instrumental vibe for today. So we'll go for this one. And hopefully these are all instrumentals. Yeah. There we go. So I can, I can switch it up a little bit. Although we are hearing a god awful uh, organ music right now. I don't like the sound of organs. I've realized that. I've realized they're just they're just really, really not for me. Um, also, if you guys remember, Claudia is, ooh, she would be aging up. It's not gonna do it though, right? Cause she's a, she's a vampire, right? Yeah, okay, it's not aging her up. Um, what I was thinking this episode is I really, 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 would like to focus on making a little bit of cash. So, I might actually, oh, Riku's home. Perfect timing. I know you're a bit miserable, but please can you come in here and paint? Because I really need the money. I can still hope. This ain't instrumental. There we go, this is. Uh, yeah, I can't upload my own CC folder, guys, because I don't own the rights to the CC, so there we go. You should send one of the vampires to uni. I hate uni, though, in this game. It's just not that fun. Hey beautiful, do you want to go on a date today? If your ghost body wants to give me a massage, then I'm game. Let's do it. Let's have a little massage. Um, how do you kill Sims with vampires? There's a mod I download. Uh, there's a mod that I download specifically for it. I don't know if it's called like realistic vampires or what, but yeah, it is based on a mod. Okay, you're humiliated. I wish they'd get over the celebrity home quirk. Like it's low key kind of annoying. Also, why doesn't painting increase your fun? That's what I want to know. Okay, boom. I'm going to start selling. And then start painting again, because I need the money. We'll just vibe out and chat. How long have I been live? I've been live for an hour and a half. We spent the first half of the stream, though, editing... Um, ooh. I'm so good at sleeping, I could do it with my eyes closed. Did I make you laugh? Oh my gosh, why does he low-key look a bit vampy there? No. <laughs> Stop texting my man! Okay, he's happy because he's near his master. His master is, of course, this lovely lady here, Claudia. Where are you off, babes? What are you doing? Oh, you have to go get a massage from your ghost husband, ghost boyfriend, who is also the father of your kids. He is being influenced. He is. It's, give, it's made him more inspired, though. 
I always thought painting increased this. Super upset that it doesn't. Uh, now he's off for a wee and why don't you get yourself a little sleep as well. Can I sell this? Okay, so wait, wake up and sell that and then you can go to sleep. Boom. And some kids at school being mean to one of your friends. Stop lying, you have no friends. Don't even say such things. Please keep working on your skills. Oh man, they're thirsty again, guys. Okay, we might... Oh, hello. <gasps> oh, I was just about to kill her. Rude. Uh, I might have to have a little scour around the neighborhood. Lucifer is hungry. He's got food. He's just been a brat. He's just been a brat. Okay, um, if I'm not careful, they're gonna end up killing Riku. So, I need to uh, I need to try and find someone for them to drink on. Honestly, everyone in the family is evil, so all they ever do is be horrible to each other. And as a result, all the family really hate each other. But what can you do? What can you do? I hear the the vibe at the romance festival is pretty cool. Do you want to come and check it out with me? I need somebody to invite themselves here. Like that isn't ideally what I need people to do because then I can drink their blood. You should age up Lucifer. No, he's a vampire cat. <gasps> yes, thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, both the kids can eat. Yay. Okay, Thorn Bailey. Nom nom nom. And that other person that came round. Nom 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 as well. Can you guys hear the music? It's like really happy and vibey. Music is kind of loud. Okay, I'll switch it down a little bit. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna just have in-game music instead. So there we go. I can switch this up so you can hear what's going on in game. Um, and where was the other? Wait, aren't you meant to be drinking from Thorn Bailey? Hello, rude. Please do as you're told. You drink Thorn Bailey and you, where is the lady that we invited around to our house? You can drink from her. It's the death dance, guys. You love to see a uh, little boogie, little boogie on onto your de to your eventual doom. We love it. Here we go. And this just shows, guys, how much Draco is growing up. He has no qualms. Look, she's come out being like, oh, yay, well done. I'm so happy for you. He does look a bit creepy when he's doing that. Oh, yes. And Maya's dinner's arrived as well. Do you just love it when you order a takeout and they come really quickly? I do. So, nom, nom, nom. Nom, nom, nom time. And this should set out their thirst for a little bit. One thing I'm kind of realizing is that bullied child, you don't even go to school. You're not bullied, don't lie. Um, one thing I'm kind of realizing is children, honestly, death dance going on over there as well. Children honestly need feeding a lot. Like adults are able to like use one drink for a long time. Children, absolutely not. The children really struggle. Like they need feeding all the time, like literally all the time. So what have you drawn here? Oh, <gasps> yes, you're finally drawing creepy stuff. Thank you, thank you. What can you do? Can you paint on here? No, you can't. Okay, back to the organ practice. There you go, wait, where are you? No, forget crying. She escaped because she was crying. Uh, no, I don't think so. You will. You will die today, friendo. You invite yourself round to- Would you invite yourself round to a vampire house? You wouldn't. You're not bullied, don't lie. She didn't even go to school. She doesn't even go to school, so she can't be being bullied. Von Vegan, it is me, hello. Claudia is named after you, right? No, Claudia's surname is. Hi, I hope everyone is doing well. I love your Sim series, and I found a crazy cool vampire CC with a bloody eye patch and blood trips called Bloodthirst Collection by Simblarine 2020 by Pauline. Ooh. That sounds good. I did see some of you guys link in CC, but I totally forgot to download any of it. So thank you for reminding me. And Haley the chicken, thank you so much for the bits. The, Haley the chicken. Uh, what is uh, what? What is when Maya is a teen? She becomes like a seductress vampire. That could be a good show. Although I do wait. Is she still alive? <gasps> oh no, of course not. And you love decorating the dead bodies, don't you? What an actual artist! Like decorating in blood. Love that. Um. I feel like um, Arya's been quite a seductress vampire. Maybe we go a different direction in Maya, or maybe we make Maya even more so. I don't know. Um, Shell2000, thank you so much for two months. Hope you've had a good two months. Thank you for kicking off a little sub train again. And um, let's add some of these to our graveyard. Yay! Love that for us. 
And please be polite to Grim. He is our only family friend. So can we make sure... Stop crying over the stupid dead body. You would not be crying over it. Silly foolishness. All of you need to stop being sad about the dead bodies. Okay, I won't stand for it and I won't allow it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Boom. Uh, we need to say hi to Grim because he's a good family friend. Uncle Grim is here. Literally, he's basically like their uncle at this point. Maya should be a celebrity so she can kill her fellow celebrities and hide her being a vampire. That is one good way to get a competition, isn't it? Get rid of the competition by eating them. Last recess. Oh my gosh, please stop lying about going to school. I feel like they're just doing this to be like little trolls, honestly. <gasps> she loved that divine drink. That that person was particularly tasty. I feel like when the the food invites itself, that is when it tastes the nicest. Why can't I speak to him? There we go. Okay, guys. Please have a chit chat with the Grim. He's our only friend, so make sure you make an effort with him. Pretend to bite, lol. Get to know. Oh my gosh, look at him. Actually, full on pretending to bite him. I keep wanting to call Draco Klaus. I don't know why. He just, he's got Klaus energy to me. Okay, and we'll pop this one in the garden as well. So look, they both had to drink. Oh, I am half thirsty to be fair. Look, that didn't even fill them? It literally didn't even fill them. Like, what? The human sims are gonna go extinct if the kids eat so much. It'll keep spawning them, don't worry, as long as we don't go extinct. Lord um, Stark Jelly, thank you so much for the bits. Your graveyard is getting real big. We love to see it. I know, right? It's such a thing of beauty. I think I'll only be able to fit in maybe one more row, and then I'll have to extend it unless I move them all back one. In fact, yeah, I think we should do that. We're gonna need a bit more room in here. Remember Johnny Zest? Wow. Blast from the past. Remember Megumi who was texting my mom? Yeah, if we do it like this, everyone gets a bit more room. Actually, they get less room, but I get more room to fill it. I feel like at some point, this is gonna be bigger than the house, the way they're going, to be honest. I'm just killing everyone. Cycling through those sims, there we go, see? Now that's a much better space use, right? I love that it's a garden. <laughs> You should date Grim. I wanted Claudia to date Grim. I actually really want to do the challenge where you romance um, like every type of um, romance. Should we ask what the Grim Reaper's into? What does a Grim Reaper dig? I wanted to do the challenge where you have every occult baby. Um, so I feel like we should do that at some point, but obviously I've got two pretty big challenges going on at the moment. Grim likes body piercings. Wait, haven't we asked him this before? I'm pretty sure he said this before as well. If you've got body piercings in the chat, the Grim Reaper likes you. You can use that to your advantage one day. Okay, kids, please crack on with learning your skills. Thank you. That's kind of a cute monster, but okay, whatever. Uh, uh, no, don't draw an animal. Draw a monster and you. Please crack a lock on with the practice. Are you awake yet? Okay, time for you to wake up. Go ahead and have a bubble bath to increase your fun. Uh, please go ahead and uh, eat some leftovers. And then I need you to keep on painting. You're too tense because your fun is low. You want to woohoo with Claudia. It would increase his fun. If she'll allow it, I'll let them do it. Oh my gosh, yay, I'm gonna marry Grim. I can't wait. <laughs> uh, we've also got... You leader, have you finished watching Bridgerton? The Duke is low key hottie. The Duke is high key hottie in Bridgerton. He's gorgeous. Uh, no, I haven't finished watching it yet because we were watching it with my mum and I want to keep watching it with my mum. But obviously, um, I can't because we're in lockdown at the moment. So I need to wait for lockdown to, to be lifted so that I can actually see my mum again. And then when I do see her, we will watch some more Bridgerton. Right now, we're watching Cobra Kai and we're watching every Wednesday The Expanse. I love The Expanse. I love Amos in The Expanse. I just, I really love Amos. Also, I love Drummer in The Expanse. If you watch The Expanse, I love, I love The Expanse so freaking much. Um, and I'm a big simp for Amos and a very big simp for Drummer. So let me know if any of you guys are, um, uh, also simps for those two. I know not everyone watches Expanse. It's not quite as popular as the others, but I love them. I love it. 
Do you even geek? Thank you so much for being here for four months. Hello, hello. Hope you're having a pleasant start to the new year. I've gotten back into Sims thanks to you and now I'm doubling in some CC. Yes, it's a slippery slope. Come join us on the dark side. And Audrey, Anna, thank you so much for the 100 bits. I usually get to catch your VODs on YouTube, but finally managed to have one watching the stream from the beginning because I usually wake up by the end of the stream because I'm preparing to start work tomorrow. I'm excited and love you lots. Thank you so much for joining us. Nice to have you. And also Laura Rosewell, thank you so much for being here for three months in a row, four months in total. What do you think about Riverdale? I don't love Riverdale. I'm sorry, I just... I watched two seasons of it and then it got a bit stupid. What do you think of the end of Dark? Loved it. Dark is one of the best TV shows I've ever watched. I just low-key adore it. It's amazing. <gasps> I love all of these. Like, look, these little monster drawings are so cute. Let's keep drawing some more of those. You on... No, stop feeling sad. You're thinking about your first woo-woo. Should I allow those guys a quick woo-woo in the shower to boost his fun? I might do. I might do just real quick. Just real quick, if she allows it, you know, she has needs too. She is furious about something. I think she's gonna say no. Oh? No. <laughs> it's just woo-woos to her, it doesn't mean anything. Did I make it so that she can't get pregnant anymore? She's still furious. Oh, oh, jeez. Imagine finishing woo-woos, you turn around being like, oh, so how, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, jeez. The woo-woos were that good. The woo-woos were that good that... Oh, I think we're gonna have to build a basement and lock her in there soon because she's freaking me out. She is freaking me right out. Honestly, she is. Um, but for that, we need more money. And how did that not boost your fun more? What? Okay, he's listening to that to boost his fun. Fair enough. Uh, and then can you do some painting, please? Huh? Claudia just aged up? How did that happen? I don't understand. I don't understand that at all. What? She's a vampire? How did that just happen? You finished eight to eight day one class. I'm so obsessed with uh, Siri. Oh my gosh. If you liked, is it so 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 I've forgotten how you say his name. I have to like write in. Is it like? So, so, yes. Yuri. Oh, how? Was his name sp spelt like that? Oh my gosh, I don't know why I even try and show you guys stuff on a piece of paper. Can you see that? Yeah, was his name spelt like that? Oh my gosh, it's backwards. Um, if you like, if you like him, he is my, I think he's probably my favorite, um, South Korean actor. He's called Park Sejun, and he's in a bunch of stuff. You need to watch She Was Pretty. I think that's his best hair era, and he's a complete babe in that. Like, he is a complete babe in that. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to get you guys a picture. She Was Pretty. Um... And it's funny, it's quite a light-hearted one. His hair looks really good in it too. Um, let's find a good picture. Oh, this is good, but it's tiny. Oh, it's because it's a gif. No, stop giving me gifs. Don't worry, that you're not missing much. They're just playing that stupid organ. If anything, I'm saving your precious ears from it. Yeah, his hair's good in this. Oh, beautiful hair. Yes. Okay, here we go. Where is his hair in it's a one class? Let's face it, is god awful. Um, so, oh, where did he go? <laughs> Rude. There we go. So, if you liked um, it's a one class, my man's hair can look like this. So, oh, Lucifer can't get up the stairs. You guys are saying. Uh, no. Oh, can you go here? Where? Where is he? Let me see if I can call Lucifer over to him. Sorry, let's get rid of Parksigen off the screen. Yeah, his hair can look like that, which looks really nice. It does look... It looks like Yoshi. I think he looks more like the guy from... Summer's Husband from my main series. Okay, let me see if I can call the cart over. Oh, he can't! Oh, jeez, how long has the poor kitten been stuck there? Okay, you know what? I think we're gonna have to age up this cart. I hate to do it, guys. I hate to do it, but he's, he's, 
I'm going to have to make him an adult, aren't I? There we go. So he can actually get around places because it's really annoying. He's he's broken for some reason. And age days in current life. There we go. Boom. So Lucifer has aged up into an adult and can now get to his food. We can also send him off to like get us stuff. Oh, he's off. He's crazy and he's going wild. Uh, we can send him off to like go get us stuff, which I think is a good idea. Like he can hunt things for us. Can I do that? Like send him off? No, I don't have the option. Boo. Um, let's sell that, and you can start another painting. Oh, can I show you one more, um, good picture of Park Sejun's hair? He's in a really good show. Actually, this show's better. This show is called What's Wrong with Secretary Kim. Um, and it's so good. It is literally so good. And this is how his hair looks in that. It just looks fantastiche, basically. I need to stop saying fantastiche all the time. Uh, but yeah. We do be liking you, Park Sejun. I think he's the same age as me, actually. Oh, he's born a year before me. He's a year older than me. So it's totally fine to have a crush. Don't need to feel weird like when we do when um, we crush on Felix from Stray Kids. This one's totally legit. Boom. Uh, Porsche check, thank you. You like his haircut in Ise Oh my gosh, his hair annoyed me so much in Ise It just really annoyed me. I was like, I hate it so much the whole time. Okay, there we go. Keep painting. Can you like listen to this while you paint? I mean, why would you want to? Why would anyone ever want to listen to that? I don't know. Claudia's like, Claudia, stop doing social media. Stop doing social media in the wild, okay? It's just, no. Come and like dig some holes or something. Since he's painting and since we really, uh, my barons are totally gone. Okay, it's this way. Uh, he's painting, we really need money. I'm gonna need you to start like digging and stuff. We need the money, Claudia. You're not being very helpful right now, Claudia. I might send her to a park. Um, both for snacks and also for salvage. Harvest all these as well. Boom. Actually, just the pears. I don't want it to do the main tree. And you've got work. You can go into work. Boom. Uh, have you watched the new Japanese Netflix show Alice in Borderland? No, but I've seen it on my recommended. We're currently watching um, a Korean horror TV series. I can't remember what it's called, but there's like these weird monsters um, and they move really like, you know, scuttly and weirdly. It's actually quite scary. Sweet Home. Yeah, we're watching Sweet Home. We also over the weekend watched Hashtag Alive. That was pretty good as well. Although the end of it was really stupid, but the, the rest of it was good. Outfit check. I told you guys my outfit's really boring today. It like literally jeans that I fell over. Uh, the dogs tripped me and I got a hole in them. It really hurt my knee. And then like the most basic top ever. So I'm sorry, my outfit is very basic today. We do be basic though. Some days you're allowed to be a bit de basic. Sweet home, did I say sweet Claudia? Claire, find the lottery sim Ruby Emery. Ooh, in Windendale, Windendale. I went Riverdale, Windenburg. Yes, I will do that. Maybe we can do that with, um... are you just burning casually in the sun? Wait, why do you not burn anymore? Why are you not burn baby burning? I don't know. That's weird. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> do you ever just get out in public and pose? Do you ever just do that? Is that ever just like a thing that you do? <laughs> I do this all the time. Who does not do this? Like, who does not just sit there and do this? All the freaking time. Um, okay, while the kids are just being super annoying and Riku's off to work, brilliant. I'm going to send her to Windenburg. So... Should I get the kids to come? Are they hungry? Ugh, they are a little bit hungry. Okay, fine. Let's... Oh, no, they're gonna burn. They'll burn. Let's do it. It's a nighttime activity. We'll do it at night. Who, which vampires go out in the day? Only vampires that want to die, you know? Uh, Laura Rosewell, thank you so much for being three months in a row, four months in total. And, uh, uh... I miss the amethyst. Amanda, thank you so much for the bits. I'm glad you're streaming today. I'm having a turn of anxiety and this definitely helps. Can this guy not? Can this guy not? Seriously. Seriously. What is this residence you're living at? You know what? He's done this one too many times. 
Children assemble! Where are my children? Why can't I invite them? I don't know, but we'll assemble them. Oh, what? She's gone on her own. I don't get to go with her. Wait, is he coming here? No, I wanted to go to your house and eat your family. Oh, rude. Okay, now she's burning in the sun. Definitely get inside, please. Your vampire energy is low. Please, can you do some meditation? And then do some hibernation. I've got a lucrative opportunity. Can you take the money? Yes. I am more than happy to take money. I don't care if it's illegal. That does not bother me one bit. I'm glad you're streaming today. I'm having a ton of anxiety. This definitely helps. I'm glad to take your mind off things. Eagle3232, thank you so much for gifting a sub. Please make sure you say thank you in the chat if you were gifted. Silky Gamer, do you like Gossip Girl or Teen Wolf? Love Gossip Girl. Seen it like three times. Uh, Choke Bass is the one for me. Uh, Nate is the most boring human in existence. Serena is pure raw and... Uh, um, Blair is a queen. And if you think any differently, I'm, I hate to break it to you, but you're wrong. Sorry about that. Um, also, Kyla, thank you so, so much for the bits. Lisa Owens, thank you so much for the bits. Much love, Claire. Um, this girl needs to stop doing this now. She's just really annoying me. The, the kids are honestly just so miserable. Um, please don't draw the same thing twice. Rude. Um, because they constantly, because they're evil, they always argue with each other. So they're constantly around people with sentiments that they hate. So, I should try and make them make it up a little bit. Like, no, don't be mean to her. Can you not be nice? Like, do... Vampiric Jewel, okay. New change of plan! Change of plan! We're gonna be doing a Vampire Jewel, because it's more fun. Be mean to Riku, jeez. They're, they're horrible kids. They are horrible kids. Um, Lisa Owens, thank you so much for the bits. Much love. Kyla, thank you so much for the 200 bits. I really appreciate the stream today because I've just come to terms with my sexuality and pronouns. So the stream has made me feel really happy, accepted, and loved. So thank you so, so much. By the way, I am pansexual and my pronouns are she and they. <gasps> the same as uh, what we did earlier. She and they. I love that. I'm glad you got that representation with um, through Andy there. And Water Unicorns, thank you so much for the bits as well. Claire, I give you uh, my bits because you are awesome. Oh, thank you so, so much for the beautiful bits. Okay. Um, what about Dan Humphrey? Dan's just kind of low-key. He's also quite ratty. Uh, he almost saw the light for a while when he was into Blair, and then he just ruined it all, so, you know, pure rat energy. Uh, did you guys have your vampire jewel, by the way? Did I just totally miss that? Did I miss the vampire jewel? What? Stop being a crybaby. Did you- did they- did they do the vampire jewel? Ask what Draco's problem is. Um, Vampire Jewel, there we go. I know it's bad and they hate each other and it makes them miserable, but... Fight for my entertainment, children! Please fight for my entertainment. Ooh, loads of stuff to harvest in here. Okay, do a Vampire Jewel. What is this? Is it that That was the lamest jewel I've ever seen. That wasn't a jewel at all! Maybe it's because they're children. I don't know, either way. Annoying! Hate that. Chuck Bass is king. Claire, one of them could die. Oh my gosh, is that how how vicious vampire jewels are? I had no idea. I mean, that's one way to decide the air, right? That is one way to decide the air. Phoebe, thank you so much for being for three months in a row, six months in total. Thank you so much for everything. Uni with COVID was so hard. Five to nine weeks of isolating, jeez. It's the point where I was diagnosed with depression. Thank you so much for helping me through it. I love you. Phoebe, I'm so, so sorry that you had to go through that. Serena was queen. Um, I'm sorry, no. Serena thought she was the queen. Serena, for me, was really annoying because she spent the whole show pretending like she was a nice person, and she wasn't. And, like, Blair was not a nice person, but she owned that and accepted that. Serena pretended that she was, and she wasn't. And that's why I don't like Serena. Uh, Nevmar, thank you so much for being here for four months. Who else? I didn't like Jenny either. Jenny was a rat because obviously Rachel. Blair was the queen and she went against Blair. Okay, so the kids are, are enjoying yelling at their dad's ghost, which, you know, that's nice for them. Uh, hey, Riku, I was wondering, I have, an, I have a confession. I haven't been able to stop thinking about you in a romantic way. I was wondering if you feel the same. Riku, reel him in. Reel him in so we can kill him. Okay, he's at work, but we'll invite her around this evening and fresh noms. Gossip Girl isn't on Netflix anymore. What? Similar Reese, thank you so much for the bit. Similar Reese, thank you so, so much. Thank you for cheering. 
Did you see the end of the vampire video game tournament? They were neck and neck, guys. <gasps> we love a good vampire pun. Um, and then when you get home, oh, your energy is super annoying. I hate stupid humans with their stupid sleep in. So annoying. What are you doing? Reckon. Okay, great. And where is Lucifer? Just vibing. He still looks cool as an adult, but I did like his kitten form. I wanted to be able to send him off to bring us stuff. Can I can I train them to do that? Is that like a thing I can do? Like If I if I get to know them enough, will they bring me back presents that I can sell? Cuz that would be super handy. So I might try and do that. Cuz we've only got 2000 pounds right now, and this house is going to take several thousand, you know. Riku is home. Get some sleep. Wait, invite her around, then get some sleep. There we go. You should train the kids to learn self-defense. How do I do that? Only with a specific trait. Boo. Are there vampire teeth you can give the cat? I'm pretty sure vampire... Uh, um, cats just have vampire teeth, you know? Okay, who is the hungriest? You're kind of thirsty. You're thirstier still. Okay, it's gonna have to be one of these two. Which one of you wants nom noms? Ooh, creatively level 10. Nice. The heat drawn mo monsters. Let's have a look at this one. That does not look finished to me. Oh, he's just seething in his chair. I will get her to finish it, but I want her to build up. I like the idea that she gets on with the cart. The cart is, however, not having any of it. There you go. Okay, Draco, um, have you got the option to drink uncontrollably? No. Could I always invite her in? She do be walking, very sassy. Very sassy. And she's talking to his ghost as well. <gasps> is that a trash plant? No! Oh, I hate trash plants, gang. No, how do I kill it? How do I get rid of this trash plant? Please, 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 someone let me know. Because I've had this before and I couldn't get rid of it. And, like, that was it then. I was just stuck with a trash plant. Outside the Villarreal house, I had three. Delete it in buy mode. Okay. Oh, these two are arguing. Oh my gosh. On the Villarreal property, they were, like, off the lot. So as a result, I could never get rid of it. And I can't even tell you how much it used to annoy me. It used to drive me absolutely mad. There we go. Okay, so this evening we're going to go to Windenburg and try and find that lottery winner. Once the sun goes down. Obviously, I can't do much until the sun goes down. Thank you guys for letting me know. It's 3am where you are. What? Get some bed. Get some sleep. Tay Unsley, thank you so much for being here for three months in a row. I'm so glad you're here. I need a distraction today. I've got to get a root canal at two and I'm terrified. Thank you from a fellow adult simmer. Ooh, root canal, sending you big love. Hope it goes okay. It does sound quite scary, but I hope it goes okay. Okay, I'm waking him up so that we can get some money. Sell everything, please. Thank you. And where is this woman? Is she still in her house? Yeah, she is. I want one of the kids to become uncontrollably hungry and just eat her, to be honest. Yes. Perfect. Wait, is she flirting with Claudia? I think she is a little bit. I don't think Claudia's having any of it though because she wants to attack her. Remember to save, good child. Let's do that. Elizabeth, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peaches. Make sure you say hello to them in the chat. And Martina, thank you so much for the bits. Glad you wanted to support you in your stream because I've watched you since 2016. That is awesome. Thank you so much. Um, Sabina, just wanted to say I love you. Uh, thank you. And you make my day. I've been having a bad week. Um, but you have made me happy and learned to love myself. Uh, I hope you enjoy your day and I'm sending you wonderful blessings your way. I love you, beautiful queen. Thank you so much for the sweet message. And Kamala says, if you're trying to get rid of a trash plant, take cuttings until it dies and then you can throw it away. <gasps> that is such a good show. I didn't even know curtains would eventually kill it. Thank you so much for that tip. Okay, boom. There we go. Oh, yep, she's dead. That's fine. Uh, getting loads of money this way. Can he reach all of these? Hopefully he can. I don't know if you can reach the mandrakes back there. 
No, you can't. You can't. We're all good. Boom. Is that everything? Witness death. No, you don't. Don't concern yourself with that, babes. Get back to your gardening. Good man yourself. There you go. Is that everything? Okay, that's everything. Right. The sun is setting. It is time for us to go back out on the prowl. Uh, and, wow, that was quick, Grim. Things you love to see. Let's do a bit more flirting with him. Uh, romance. I can hear Lexi barking somewhere. Um, we'll pop this little urn into the garden. Ooh, we got some things to sell. Boom. Uh, who's got an urn? Who's got an urn? Wait, sell that. Twelve dollars, nice. Who's got an urn? Where did the urn go? Huh? Am I being dumb? Where's the urn? Did I give it to Riku? Oh, bless him. Lol. Poor thing, he does not want that in his inventory. But he flirted with my mums, so... It was necessary, you know? And then, let's get this little party on the road. End that. Let's do ourselves a little travel. Wait, why can't I travel? Forget this hanging with lover. End it! What? what why is it stuck? <gasps> I can't end the social event. It's stuck. Um. Okay, I know how to do it. No, not that way. <gasps> I can't exit live mode. Oh my gosh. My social event is broken. Um, I'm kind of low-key trapped. Think I should send him away? Okay, see if he goes, it ends the event. Okay, this is not good. <laughs> this is not good. Uh, I can't end this event. Yeah, yeah, which, unless it finishes at 12. Let's see if it's going to end at 12. And a vampire energy is low. Okay, can you do dark meditation as a child? I don't know if you can. Where's your vampire things? Oh, you can. <gasps> Children, I can't believe you haven't been doing dark meditation. Please get on that. Improve your vampire energies. <gasps> yes. Can you hear the doorbell, by the way? I'll get it in a sec. She do be floating, though. <gasps> Love this. Doing a little bit of floating vibes. Yes, my children. Good job. Good job. Did you sell your painting? Please come sell this. And go back to bed. Okay, I can't send them to Windenburg this evening, which is really sad. Oh, yeah, I do need to post my nuts so berry. What time are we on? Oh, it's a minute past five. Let me just make sure I've got the video. I still need to upload it. I'm sorry. Da da da. Elizabeth, did I catch your subscription? If not, welcome to the peaches. Uh, yeah, I can't send them visiting, which is super annoying. I'm locked into this event. Can she hibernate without going crazy? Let's have a nosy. <gasps> yes, okay, she's getting some sleep. Nice. The kids' e e energy is low. But we're currently sharing a coffin, though, just because we don't have enough, which is obviously big suds. Stop trying to cry over people. <gasps> and he needs to feed. Maybe I can just send the... No, I can't just send the kids. I can't travel, can I? Okay, this is not good because Draco needs to feed. But I can't see any willing tributes. Not ideal. Uh, Chelsea, thank you so much for being here for seven months. Hope you've had a good seven months. Where's the vid? It will be coming soon. It will be coming soon. They can use beds, I know, but it just is so human and gross that I don't want to subject them to that. Um, please, can you come and finish this monster? Thank you. And is there any other skills I should be making them learn? I said I would make them learn old skills only. So a science kit's probably a little bit too new, isn't it? <gasps> what? How did you just get fireworks coming out of your drawer in? Don't know, but I like that. Draw some more monsters. 
Zero skills with the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten gifted subs. Please, can we get some love in the chat for zero skills, please? In fact, can you send some little hearts in the chat so I can blow them over to them because they have gifted ten of you guys with the gifted subs. If you were just gifted a sub, please make sure you say thank you in the chat and send a bunch of hearts in the chat for zero skills 101. Thank you so much for the support and for gifting my community there. That means a lot to me. You got some hearts for you here. Enjoy. Your little heartsies and also Flissy J, thank you so much for the bitch. You're having a really hard time right now. You're feeling heartbroken and you're glad you can watch this to keep you distracted. I'm glad we will definitely try and take your mind off things and keep you distracted in today's stream. Okay. His fun being low is honestly very annoying. Very annoying. We're gonna oh she's possessed. Oh jeez. Inner slippers and her charcoal face mask. Oh, oh my gosh, this is even creepier than normal. <laughs> There's something about this that's even worse somehow. <gasps> oh no, it's a Louis Vuitton mask. She she has got wearing Louis. This is not the way that Louis imagine Louis Vuitton should be worn. Um but yeah, she's uh <laughs> she's wearing a Louis Vuitton face mask there. He's getting super hungry. I need to be careful. I need to be really careful with him. Please have Maya practice her voice skills. Okay. Um, let me go and get a microphone. Microphone. Uh, here we go. It's not too much money. And it kind of goes with the decor. And it is an old skill. So I think this kind of works. And we can get Maya doing a little bit of singing practice. There we go. Sad because you're insecure. Do you believe that the way you look isn't great? You have to learn to accept yourself by killing humans. That is how you do it as a vampire. Oh, it's like she's really tiny. Let's see how she sounds. Oh no. Oh no. Oh babes. Oh, okay. There we go. She's better than me. She's honestly much better than me, I've got to say. Oh, okay, so you guys are saying that slice of life is causing the issue. If you remove the personality parts, it fixes it. I had to log out of the game completely yesterday because it got stuck in an event. Oh, okay, that's definitely not what I wanted to hear. So I'm stuck in this event until I exit my game and restart it. Not ideal. Not ideal. Can you upload notes of broke? Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. I told you guys I'm working on it. It's not, I don't have the file yet. So you have to wait, I'm sorry. Might be a 6 p.m. upload, I'm afraid, or I might do it at the end of the stream. So, yeah, that might have to be how it has to go. Okay, Riku babes, I really need you to get up and start working a bit harder. You're not working very hard at the moment. I need you to use that toilet. I need you to repair this. I need you to repair that. Uh, then you'll be able to have a shower, but you need to get crack a lack in. <laughs> Butler, come on. Go on vacation? No, you will not be going on vacation. Absolutely not. <gasps> and he never got to woo with Claudia because she became possessed midway through. Oops. Okay, we'll try that again then. We will try that again. Stop updating your social media status. What? What's the Life Force mod? That's that vampire mod that I use. So, um, a vampire can restore it. His has been permanently full though. I don't really understand what that means. I do not get what that means. Freezing to death? What? How can a vampire freeze to death? I'm sorry, but what? That is so dumb. She's running back inside to get warm. How can a vampire freeze to death? They don't even feel the cold. They don't even feel the cold. This makes literally zero sense, but whatever. Woo woo sleeves. Um, she doesn't currently have any. Uh, but they're not doing try for baby. They're just doing woo woos. I actually think because I updated wonderful whims. I need to turn wonderful settings. Pregnancy settings. No, I don't want the native pregnancy override. So it should still have the try for baby. Oh gosh. Pregnancy settings. Woohoo settings. Mm. 
Hmm, I can't see the try for baby option. Did I remove her ability to have babies? I kind of don't feel like I did. Guys, please stop asking about the video. I've said that I'm still working on the video. I don't have the file yet, but it will be here soon. Please, if you don't spam the chat with her, okay? Her. Oh, did she say no? Did she say no to woo woos? Oh, I do want them to woo woo, but I definitely don't want her to get pregnant, so I'm gonna have to be careful. And he needs to work on his fun. Why don't we repair this and then you can play dolls with one of the kids? You do just be repair. No, Draco, don't go to school! Don't go to school! Get home right now! Get home right now! Come home, come home, come home! Leave! Don't go to school with the normie kids. I know you're hungry. He probably just did it because he was so hungry. Uh, and he's burning. Oh my gosh. We need we need to feed him. We need to feed him! Can you invite around one of your human friends? <gasps> We've eaten all of his friends, guys! We've eaten every single one of Riku's friends, so we can't eat any of them. Claudia. Okay, I'm gonna join her because we need to do a treatment. Um, and I might be able to bring Draco to work. I don't think I can do. <laughs> you could buy plasma. Ew, no. We only drink straight from the source in this house. Zero skills, thank you so much for for two months. Thank you for sending such good vibes to everyone. Be following you since the Skyrim era. <gasps> One of my favorite eras. One of my absolute favorite eras. Summon Draco. I could use cheats to summon him. Can I bring him here? <gasps> no, I can't bring him here. Boo. Okay. Why don't you build um, your social skill? Why don't you build your social skill? And why don't you care for yourself? And that's going to increase his fun. Bish bash bosh. Okay, this was actually the best solution we could have come up with. Okay, let's get back on treating our stupid humans. We have to save them if we want to kill them. That is the rules of the game. So let's do a little uh, examine. Uh, please don't sneeze on me, thanks. <gasps> Why do you have big ears? Oh my gosh, look at her character model right now. There we go. She had ears for a second then. Oh, I'm not answering the principle, but not. You used to play Skyrim. I have a load of Skyrim videos on my channel. Go check them out. Skyrim or Sims? Um, if I'm playing off stream, I would probably pick um, Skyrim over Sims, personally. I find it a more fun game to play, like, on my own, I guess. Um, can I get you a treadmill test? Refer for a treadmill test. There we go. But yeah, if I'm playing on my own, I will play um, Skyrim. But if I'm playing for YouTube, then I will play Sims. So, Order a pizza and kill the delivery man. Ooh, that's a good shout. She's bored of this. She hates boring humans. I think as, as soon as I cure them, I should eat them. Because then we're just making sure that we're not eating like um, gross. Ooh, guys. Does anybody know which one it is? Take his temperature. Oh, I need to take a sample. I'm really bad at like diagnosing patients. I just cannot be bothered. So <laughs> I'm gonna see if this gives me like a surefire result. Danisaurus, thank you so much for subscribing. Using your Switch Prime. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, still don't have my file yet for Nuts of Berry, but it is coming. I think it's gonna be a 6 p.m. upload going along. Okay, please give me a certain diagnosis. Analysis complete. It was inconclusive. Oh my gosh, which one do you have? Me medical for throw. Let's do an x-ray scan. Hopefully this will tell us. I just need to know for definite so I can treat him, then I can eat him. I don't want to be eating anyone with germs, you know? Skyrim mini version blades. Is that the mobile game? I've never played that. I wonder which one you guys prefer. Which one do you prefer to play? Skyrim or Sims? Let me know. I'll move this out your way. Social level six. What, did it say the results were inconclusive again? Oh my gosh, please. I don't, I still don't know what he has. How can, oh, what? Guaranteed diagnosis, yes. Yes, you got the llama flu. Ugh. 
<laughs> Boom. So that means now I should be able to treat him. Oh, it was there. Treat patient, Llama Flu Injection. Yay! And this is the final patient I need to treat. Oh, promotion task. Boom. Done. Okay, and now... Wait, wait, wait. Uh, should I just take his life spirit? Wait, no, I don't want him as my cattle. I'm not hungry enough. He's going to escape. Quick. Don't let him escape! I know that he's free from human pesky ailments, so I should eat him. Um, quick, chase after him with some medical advice. No, stop escaping. Stop escaping in the snow. Ah! He got away, guys. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. As soon as I treat them, they disappear, which is really annoying because uh, obviously I want to eat them. Obviously, I want to eat them. What else are these pesky humans for if not eating, you know? What else are they for? Very annoying. Is Claudia still infected? She is. Eventually, we're going to have to send her down into the basement that we'll build because she's super infected. She is super, super infected. And, uh... She's slowly starting to lose her sanity. I like the idea of weak diagnosis, decent diagnosis. Um. So yeah, once she loses it, oh my gosh, stop it, principal. Once she loses it, we'll put her in this the basement, and we'll just put her in one of the coffins, and then she'll just remain there for the end of time. <laughs> Um, Shies of Fancy, Shies so fancy, thank you so much for gifting two subs there. Welcome to the squad, new peaches, we're a 15 sub train. Please make sure you go ahead and say thank you in the chat if you, uh, if you were just gifted there. It's still between two, does that mean I have to do some more tests? Annoying! Can Claudia become an actress? No, she's a doctor. She is a doctor. It was meant to be a, a front so that we could eat people, but she's ended up actually really needing to get um, promoted and stuff in order to get money. So it kind of ended up, we, we ended up taking it more seriously than we went to. Uh, you've missed two posture techs and dehydrates. Okay, posture tech together, guys. Up, back, down, and hydrate. I'm actually... I've drank the whole of this, so no more hydrates, because otherwise I'll just be peeing absolutely non-stop. And we've also got ourselves a little bit of a hype train! <laughs> Woohoo! Saucy Marie, thank you so much for kicking off the hype train with your two-month subscription. Found your channel during lockdown, it has really helped me when I've been feeling down. I'm so glad! That is absolutely awesome news. Ooh, she wants to woo-woo. Uh, that's awesome news. I'm so glad it was able to help you. Lockdown was tough um, on a lot of us, so I'm glad you got some solace with that. Yeah. Ellen Harmon, thank you so much for the bids. Feeling the hype train. Woo -woo! Love that. Thank you so, so much. Have we got a diagnosis for her yet? Ugh. This woman is driving me mad. Starry eyes. Okay, boom. We know what she's got. <laughs> uh, so we're going to diagnose her and treat her illness. Treat patient, starry eye meds. And wait, can I just reset her so she doesn't go anywhere? Oh, yes. Okay, now. Now, 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 now. You do be thirsty though. I can actually get what the whole reason I come to work every day. So just eat stupid humans, especially ones that are like, be not, look how bright she is. If any human deserved to die, it was this one. In the corner here where no one can see. Yes, you've got cool hair. Yes, you're actually low-key quite cool looking sim, but right now you are just vampire me. Nom nom nom. We gotta eat to survive. It's you or me, you know? Zero skills. Thank you so much for feeling the hype train. Woo woo! Ellie Rose Games, thank you also for feeling the hype train. Woo woo! And zero skills again with double hype hype train. Woo woo! Thank you so much for the hype there. I appreciate that. Fueling the hype train. Uh, haven't you heard of Posmo? Oh, jeez, I forgot there was a little kid in there. Uh, uh, I kind of want to kill him as well, no? 
That was some sweet, sweet plasma. I'll definitely be coming back for more. Well, you won't, because Yuki's dead. Yuki Bear is dead. Bye, Yuki Bear. Good night and good bless. And we've almost finished work. Yay. Analyze the sample. 1.7 viewers. That's awesome. 1.7K. I love that. Maya should do the new career in the next pack. Oh, is this going to be like a ghosty pack? I feel like it is. <gasps> what a lovely end to the day when it was... So Look, good bedside mana. Oh, she just killed one of her patients. I've never seen worse bedside mana. And, okay, we did a fun... <laughs> we did a fantastic job today. We definitely killed someone, but okay. Hopefully we'll get a promotion next time. That's what it's all about. And Ra... Uh Ra Ra Rama, thank you so so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peaches. Thank you for fueling the hype train. Woo woo. Dennis, thank you so much for being here for seven months. Also fueling that hype train. Woo woo. Hope you've had a good seven months. I forgot the urn. It will be there next time I go to work. Don't worry. We will get it next time we head to work. Oh, we got stupid bills to pay. Just when I started to build up a little bit of money for renovations. Are you kidding me? How was your funds? What is going on with your life force? No. Draco just killed him. Draco, you weren't even that thirsty. Draco just killed Riku. Oh my gosh, no. No, 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 no. Draco just killed Riku. I just get home. Don't cry and pretend like this wasn't you, you little brat. This was all you. Draco just killed Riku. Okay. Okay, no. No, 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 no. I can't believe he's just done that. She's actually down for once. Where is Grim? Me and Grim are pretty tight. Surely he's gonna spare him. Okay. I'm gonna- This is the first and only time I think I will ever do this. But I'm gonna plead for Riku. Because I need a butler. Okay, Grim. I need a butler. Please understand me on this. I'm gonna plead for Riku. Grim. Grim, 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 Grim. Come on. You and me, we go way back. We go way back. No freaking way! Oh my gosh! A sentiment gained. Wow, you literally saved my life. Words can't begin to describe how grateful I am. Really, I won't forget this. Riku has been brought back to life. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is why we are tight with Grim. Oh my gosh. Can she woo-woo Grim now? <laughs> Thank you, Grim. <gasps> Thank you so much! Oh my gosh, Riku, get yourself to bed, my love. Get yourself- don't go research mushrooms. I've no- I, I didn't realize that was a sentiment you could get. Awed by life-saving hero. Claudia literally saved Riku from the clutches of death. Riku is grateful and amazed. Wow. Oh my gosh, please get some sleep. Oh no, you're actually fine. Do some work. <laughs> I'm glad you're alive. Now harvest all of these mushrooms, thanks! Oh my gosh, Grim, you absolute freaking hero. Thank you so much for that. Thank you so much. You don't even understand. You don't even understand. Oh! Okay, well, you definitely can't be air if you're gonna kill Riku. Like, seriously. Seriously. Uh, hi, Cla I'm Claudia, I'm here for you. We can go through this together. You don't have to go through this alone. Oh, well, yet again, the takeaway has invited itself round, so that's nice. I'm definitely gonna lay it on thick with Grim now. I'm so glad that we're close. Literally, super romantic compliment. Draco is literally super evil. Super evil! Like, not even just casually evil like the rest of us. He is next level evil. Next level. I even let him eat the other day. I can't believe he's- God, you're just perfect! <laughs> That's what she just said to Grim. oh my gosh. 
I'm so, so glad that went the way it did. Zero skills, thank you so much for feeling the hype train. Woo woo! And again, twice. Woo woo! Janelle, thank you so much for being here for two months. Hope you've had a good two months. Haley the chicken, thank you so much for feeling the hype train. Woo woo! You should marry the Grim and become known as the Bride of Death. Yeah, but then he won't be the Grim anymore and we won't be able to. Ooh, Grim Re Reaper fans would be quite attractive. Um, and then we won't actually be able to. Uh, um, Use him to bring back Riku if it ever happens again, which, you know, it can do when you've got vampire children rolling around the place. And Hufflepugs, thank you so much for the vids! Woo -woo. Riku is literally the alien from Toy Story. You've saved our lives! We are eternally grateful! The Claw! <laughs> literally, he is. I smile when I'm thinking about you alone. She is laying on thick with Grim right now. Riku's getting some sleep. He actually can't believe what just happened. Bless him. I never wanted him to die. And where is the meat that just invited itself round? Someone was like, I'll be there for you, Claudia. Which idiot was it? He had a hat on? Which which idiot was it? Look, most of my friend list is dead. I swear they had a hat on. Who, who was this Egypt? Where is this Egypt gone? I can't find him. <gasps> here oh we didn't have a heart <gasps> oh my gosh yes they've come round okay so stop this happening again kids how are you doing oh my gosh you're thirsty as well okay boom fish bash bush boom a successful hype train thank you guys so much for fueling the hype train there thank you thank you thank you and jeez, I feel like uh, Maya would have been pretty close to doing the same if we weren't careful. So that is definitely really, really lucky. Actually cute mother and daughter time here. Uh, mother and son time, sorry. Maya is off to go kill the Egypt who wanted to make us feel better about the death. Like, honestly, if you come to this house, you've got it coming your way. Like, it's, it's, you've only got yourself to blame. You've genuinely only got yourself to blame. So we're gonna have a, a few more little drinkies there. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You want some too? You want some of this too? Todrick! Todrick, don't think I won't. Don't think I won't, Todrick. This plasma really pleases my palate. Come on, stop being so sexy. Oh my gosh, she's saying that to Riku. What? What? Okay, stop being so sexy and please sell these mushrooms. Thanks. Feeling super passionate. He likes Claudia again, guys. Ever since she saved his life, he's like in awe of her again. Which is awesome for us um, because he'll start earning some money for us again because he won't be as sad. So that is amazing. Um, I still can't paint another person yet. Unless I just do... Do I do paint from reference and make them stand next to us? I need like a chair that we paint people in. Let me get a painting chair. Oh, I can't do it while a sim's dying. Okay, fair enough. Just do a normal painting for now then. Is his life force still really low? It is. A vampire could restore it though. I should restore his life force. Where is he at? He's here. Okay. Um, I've never done this before. Vampire. Restore life force. Okay, we'll do that. I don't know how it works, but... Okay. She's restoring his life force. <gasps> Boom! Okay, it's back up to Max again. He's feeling fearless from having his spirit restored. Increased resilience to men me uh, mental tampering. <gasps> I'm so glad. I'm so glad he's okay. I would actually have been low-key really sad if um, anything happened to uh, poor, little, um, poor little Riku. I'm so glad he came back from the dead. So glad he came back from the dead. Very, very happy about that. Okay. I am going to start uploading Knots and Berry in just a moment's time. Uh, give me one sec. Bish, bash, bash. Oh. Sorry, give me one sec, just setting some stuff out. There we go. Oh, and so much of the house still needs finishing. The one sad thing is I wouldn't have got any money if he died anyway, so. Have you saved recently? I haven't. Let's do that. 
Um, Shiza Fancy, thank you so much for the win. 200 bits there. Uh, Jorg Sawyer, thank you so much, Biddy, for five months. You love the series. I'm so glad. And Melly D, thank you so much for the 200 bits there as well. Um, Maya, stop feeling sad about idiots dying. We don't care. Okay, we just, we don't care. Please put this in your inventory so I can put it in the garden. Thank you. And I'm so glad we're not adding poor Riku to this. <gasps> it was so close. So close. And oh look, he's a celebrity. He's a celebrity, so they're all just in awe of him. Lol. Look at him, still thinking he's a big shot even though I killed him. You ain't such a big shot when you're dead. And oh great. Okay. We need to put her in the basement sooner rather than later, gang, because uh, she's fully lost it. She has absolutely fully lost it, I'm afraid. And his paintings are getting better, guys. Look at this. They're definitely getting a lot better. Good job. Try and get ourselves a little bit more cash. I'm, I've been desperately trying this whole episode to get cash, but it is a really slow process, like a really slow process. Uh, let's do a landscape painting. We've got these little monster paintings down here as well. Please, can you draw a monster? And how are they to close to, are they to aging up? Two days. Okay, two days till we age up, gang along. We can age them up when it gets to one day, I say. Claire, the grave of the person Maya still killed is outside. Where? I moved that one. That one's all the way down here. Look. That's who she killed. Oh, wait. That was the one that sounded a bit like um, a dinosaur. Oh, he's thirsty again. Guys, I can't keep this boy fed. I cannot keep this boy fed. He is full on a young growing man because he's getting really thirsty again. Like, you know what they say about boys being hard to feed? It's so true. I can't keep him fed. Okay, I might have to send the kids out on an expedition for food. Um, is that person still next to you? He is insatiable. His thirst is absolutely insatiable. He's gonna kill Riku again if I'm not careful. Jeez, he's he's crazy. What happened to their first kills? They're in the garden still. Uh, the garden, well, the graveyard. Okay, I don't want you killing Riku, so you and your sister. In fact, I'll just make him travel on his own because she's not that thirsty. And they hate each other. Wait, Kelsey Seagal? Who is this? <gasps> Wait, she must be nearby. Hmm, unless that's just the only person he knows. No, I'll get him to travel and then we can also try and pick up some collectibles while we're there too. You get random whistles too. Does that mean my game's a bit broken if I'm getting random whistles? Where's a good place to go and get stuff? Festival and campground. Wow, okay. Um, none of these are good for getting stuff. I think we should go to Oasis Springs and go to this park. This is the best park for getting stuff. The lottery winner, I just, I can't be bothered to hunt them down. I'm never going to find them. Unless we randomly come across them, I think we should forget about them. Melody, thank you so much for the 200 bits there. Kitty Cat, thank you so much for for two months. Hi, yay, Clay, big fan. Also, love this Let's Play Your Videos. You make me laugh when I need it most. Thank you for being awesome. And, um, ooh, some build items got removed there. Um, self, uh, being your awesome self, Peachy Love. Peachy Love, right back to you. Thank you so much for gifting a sub as well there, Kitty Cat. Okay, it's going to be kind of hard to see, but... Oh, jeez, look at this. Oh, that's quite cool. Lol. Um... Okay, you're probably gonna drink uncontrollably. Oh, you have to go chat with somebody. Okay. I kinda need you to pick up some collectibles, but it's really dark, so why don't you just vibe out for a bit? Kill who you need to kill. Do what you need to do. We know you're an absolute little savage kid, let's face it. He's washing his hands after talking to a human. Respect that, we respect that a lot. And Riku is gonna go to work. Um, I, remind, I admire your casual use of the word lol. I do do that a little bit too much. Um, I do say lol all the time. <laughs> lol. <laughs> I can't help it. Once you start doing it, I feel like that's it. Like, you will just keep doing it then. 
Slice of life is what is giving me the creepy whistle. No way! I didn't realize that. So it's slice of life doing it. Oh no. Oh no! Uh, when is the next episode of Not So Berry? It's gonna be this evening. I will be uploading it soon. Don't worry, I just haven't had a chance to do it yet. And I just want him to drink, uh, drink uncontrollably, but... I mean, he's still being a little wreck, but he's not being a murderous wreck right now. Which is really weird and surprising. Um, what should I get her to do? Maybe just build some skills. How is he not killing anyone? Why are you nice outside the house? I don't understand. You're horrible when you're inside, and then I bring you out the house and you're so much nicer. What? And you're thirsty, but you're not even killing anyone? I don't get him. I don't get him. Don't go to school. Maya, get home. Leave school. Good child. Leave school. Don't go to school. Um, What? He's not killing anyone. I don't get him. I don't understand this child. He's my flesh and blood, but I, I, I don't get him. Anyway, the main reason we came here was to get collectibles. So... Let's do that. So I can try and get a bit more cash. Get some little collectibles going. He's got a capsule. If he needs to drink uncontrollably, I'm, I'm just gonna let him do it because he's a vampire. He has needs. Don't take that from him. Uh, I can't dig any of those, which is annoying. Might get him to fish for a bit. He found a diamond. Principal's calling, but we don't care. And is that it on the collectible? We can try and get a frog. Dig that as well. Lemon tree. Nothing's really sprouted here, so that is a bit annoying. Never mind. Um What she won't leave school. I'm trying to get her to leave school. But she won't. So as soon as I get home, I'll bring her home, don't worry. I know she's in school. She snuck off into school. How dare she? But at least, um, at least this little one's doing his tasks. He's getting really thirsty. So he's definitely gonna kill someone soon. Which is the whole reason we brought him here. He's got a headache. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, is that because you're so thirsty for the flesh of humans? Oh, he's too uncomfortable. I feel like this person is just asking to get eaten. So let's go ahead and do it. Out in the park, no one will ever find your body here either. No one will ever find it. Far too far away for anyone to ever find it. Oh, she's an old woman. She picked the wrong place to go walking, didn't she? She really did. She really did. Kitty cat, thank you so much for the bits there. Get her to make friends. No, we don't make friends with humans, you know? Look at him just kneeling like, oh my gosh, can you die more quietly? I have a headache. Rude. Rude! And there, no one will ever know. Look at all these guys. No idea what we have just done. <gasps> Kitty cat, more bits, 200 bits, one, two. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Is there a not so bury today? Yes, there is, don't worry. <laughs> there is one. Um, ha ha, is he trying to bury her? Oh my gosh, is he actually trying to bury her? <laughs> what absolute little savage, what? He's burying a fee. Wow. I kind of love that for him. Oh wow, look, you did such a good job burying her. You can't even see her anymore. Good job. Please also chat. <gasps> don't pick on his appearance. Why don't you guys build a sand sand sculpture together? Oh, okay, rude, he left, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna send him home so I can pull her out of school. I love that he buried her. I think that is absolutely adorable. That's so cute! I love that he buried his dead person. What a baby. Don't be depressed, you didn't know her. There you go. <laughs> Was that Jennifer? No way. Did we just kill Jennifer? <gasps> Was that THE Jennifer? Did I just kill THE Jennifer? Did I finally get my revenge on Jennifer? I think I did. <gasps> this is such a huge moment for us. Wow, we killed Jennifer, you guys. Mooney Blue, thank you so much for the bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, The video is up, it is processing. I'm just gonna throw a thumbnail on there. 
and add the video details as well. <gasps> I love that we killed Jennifer. That's made me so happy. Yes, and she wasn't in school. The big liar. The big liar. You better not be getting hungry as well. No, jeez, I can't keep them fed. I need to age them up so I can kick one of them out because... Oh, you got promoted! Well done. We are getting a lot of heat, guys. We are getting a lot of heat because they're killing so many people. They're killing almost haphazardly, you know? And I can't keep them fed. That's the most annoying thing. Maya is not here. Yes, she is. Leave school. Leave school, Maya! OG Jennifer. She flirted with Ali um, at the very start of the series when I first made uh, my game. Pet calmingly. Um, so she deserved everything she got. She actually didn't flirt with him. I think she just called him once. Lol. <laughs> we just made some drama for the fun of it. Peachy Sasha, thank you so much for the bits. How are you doing, Sasha? Just want to remind you that I love you so much. You've helped me to become stronger and healthier. And for that, I can never thank you enough. We all love you so much. I want you to stay strong. Sending all of my love and hugs. You deserve it all. I love you. Thank you so much, Peachy Sasha. Sending you big love as well. We've got a posture check, guys. Oh, there we go. And also, Kitty Car, thank you so much for another 200 bits. Much peachy love. Much peachy love right back at you. <gasps> she did ask him on his de on a date. Oh, wow. Well, she totally deserved it then. Oh, my gosh, Principal. I don't want to listen to your stupid human call. I don't care what you've got to say. At all. I like, literally could not care less. Could not care less. And have we got another graveyard stone? <gasps> we do. Yay. Boom. We've also got a project of... Oh, medieval castle! Okay, I will allow it. I will allow a medieval castle because medieval castle. So you kids can start working on this together. Um, You come over, right, sister? You're not going to abandon me. Somebody is inviting us into their nest. Well, uh, why can't... Wait, why visiting family members? Who is this person? Why do I keep getting her? Um, well, mo oh no, I clicked off. Damn, I could have gone over to a whole house full of people to kill there. Is this someone she met in school? Oh, I wanted to go over and kill her so badly. Annoying. I clicked off by accident. Sorry about that, gang. Uh, you guys can build a medieval castle together. There you go. Medieval castles are pretty vampire-ish, so this should be nice. There we go. Mooney Blue, thank you so much for the bits. Thank you for spreading positivity and I love your videos and streams so much. It's now part of my routine in my day. I love that. I'm glad it's like part of your little routine. That's why I always like to try and upload at the same time and it's, it's frustrating on days like today where I don't manage to get it up in time because I know that um, it's your guys' routine and I don't want you to think that I haven't uploaded. Um... Okay, the video is processing so it should be up fairly soon. Just adding some bits and bobs to it now. Sorry, it's a little bit later today, Gang Lang. It should be up at the normal time tomorrow. Just gonna add, it's not got any noisiness in it. Import little end screens and whatnot. I spotted it was Jennifer. So is it the same Jennifer? Oh, <gasps> it was one of their half siblings. Oh, I forgot they've got all of these extra siblings, don't they? <gasps> Maybe I should eat them all. Is it bad to eat your siblings? I know in most circumstances it would be <laughs> definitely bad to eat your siblings, but if you're a vampire, is it still bad to eat your siblings? I don't know. I feel like you can get away with it when um, when you're a vampire. Maybe? I don't know. Let me check out their... Uh... Yeah, it was. Anne Garcia. Garcia? 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 Tarsia? I don't know how you pronounce that. Garcia? Uh, yeah, look, these are all our family members. Should we eat them all? Eat the siblings. Turn them into vampire friends. We have this whole club, don't we? Vampire club, and as of yet, nobody has had any more vampire children. Very annoying. Very annoying. Yay, well done, Draco. Can we give uh, Lucifer some food, please? And now we have a cute little medieval castle? Yay! Look at that! Vibey and adorable. I like that. That can stay. We'll put that in the house. There we go. Um, when are the kiddos aging up? Tomorrow. Final sleepy time and then they're aging up because there'll be one day left and so we will just do it there. Honestly, the kids are awful. 
<laughs> because they're both evil. They're both, uh, oh my gosh, yes, thank you. I love it when the food offers itself. Maya's kind of hungry, so this works out well. I don't know why people want to come around to my house. I honestly don't get it. But I will accept it every single time. Every single time. You're kind of hungry too. Remember you said we wanted to hang out more? No. Well, here I am. Great. I wish ghosts would stop hanging out with me all the time. Kind of give me a complex, you know? Like I can only be interesting to the dead. Do you want to go night clubbing? No, because somebody's around at the house and we need to eat them. The dollhouse is always smashed, which is very annoying. Okay, Maya, dinner's here. Maya, come get your dinner. Dinner's outside. Oh, more dinner. <gasps> See, it's almost Draco's birthday. We could do it tonight then, because I've got the I've got the pop up, and Draco is a little bit early, um, older. Wait, no, no, come come back here. Come back here right now. We'll have some noms on here. And, ooh, we got a bit of cash as well. Okay. Just while I have a bit of cash. Just while I have a bit of cash. This is where the basement is. This is eventually where we're going to have to either keep humans or keep the dead. And I'm afraid it's kind of looking like we're going to have to keep... Um... Wait, why can't I do that? Can't interact with walls. What? I don't know. Um, it's looking like we're gonna have to keep Claudia down here because she keeps getting possessed. She is infected. It looks like these kids uh, might be having to grow up a lot sooner than we'd originally planned. So we'll do like a little hallway vibes here. And then this is where we're gonna have to keep the dead. <laughs> yeah, I'll do it like that. Let me bring this over here. Okay. So what I was thinking is we'll have like a room like this, like a little sit and vibe room and then we'll have loads of coffin rooms coming off of it as well. So this is where the dead will forever be buried. Uh, oh man, I'm running out of money. And we'll have doors that will be locked. Have I got a creepy door? Yeah, maybe these kinds of doors. And each will have a coffin inside. It's the upstairs walls. Ah, I see. It's fine. It, it, it can do like this. This is the only one we can afford for her right now. And we'll put the picture of her behind her on the wall. Obviously, we can't move her in yet because we don't have a picture of her yet. Um, so I need to get a bit more money so I can buy a chair to put her in and then we'll, we'll, um, paint her and then she will be painted and placed on the wall behind where her coffin is. Dun dun dun! Spooky, right? Uh, Money Blue, thank you so much for the bits. Thank you for spreading positivity. I love your videos and streams so much. It's now part of my routine in my day. Love that. And Drenny, thank you so much for the four months. Okay, so... Um, I'm gonna wake up Riku so he can do a bit of baking for us. He's woken up feeling confident, confident that he won't get eaten today, which is real nice for him. Okay, she's dead. Awesome. Good job. She was definitely hanging around here too much. Wait! That's not who I told you to kill! You little brat! You've just killed somebody else entirely! Wow! Okay, both the kids are completely not listening to me anymore. I ha okay, who have you drunk then? Because you're thirsty. Oh, jeez. I will say vampire kids are horrifying. They are actually scary. She's in the house here. Honestly, Claudia's kind of low-key hungry, so... Maybe I'll eat her instead. Oh my god, stop mourning. We don't care about the stupid... Stop it! Stop mourning! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Um... Okay, he's getting a shower and getting ready. Um, I need to bake a cake. Why don't I... Wait, do you, still have a, do you still have a birthday cake for vampires? It's not like they're going to be able to eat the cake. It kind of feels weird, but I guess we'll make a cake. Wait, I'm going to get Riku today because he can make a spooky cake. Sorry, I got a really itchy eye. Uh, Where's the spooky cake? <gasps> spooky cake. There we go. Stop. Oh, oh you got followers from painting, I see. Um, there we go. So I'm making a little cakey for the kids. 
Uh, the kids who I'm now gonna have to keep such a close eye on. Because they're scary! They're killing everyone! I'm laughing about it manically. I hope he's still gonna look cute as a, um, as a teenager. Put your bets on now. Are they gonna look good or not? You guys are saying check on Claudia's power points! Yes! We've got another level. Okay, boom. So now technically she's a master vampire. Dampened emotions. She's cool and calm. <gasps> I like that. I like that a lot. Supernatural speed. Deprived needs. Ooh, so I can mess people up. Sun resistance. I don't like that one. I feel like they have to have a, a crutch, you know? Or odorless. She never has to get um, hygiene done again. Okay. We're going to do a poll. So, Claudia's grand... Uh, no, sorry. Vampire master. Skill. Should it be... Dampened emotions? Should it be super natural speed? Should it be deprive needs of others? Um, should it be... I don't like sun resistance. I'm going to request that we don't do this one because I think vampires should burn in the sun or else it's just too OP. Or should we do odorless never shower again? Okay, guys, go ahead and make your minds up. Let me know what you guys would like. Uh, in the meantime, I'll get her to repair this dollhouse. Uh, I'll get Maya to come home. Stop being depressed about dead people that we don't care about. Although you do need to get the urn. Please pick this up. Do this first, thank you. So I can add it to the graveyard. Oh no, look at her hair. Oh no, there we go. <laughs> Um, oh, we need a weakness as well. Okay, I will do a weakness too. Uh, parent in level two. Bless him. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and add some candles to this. Um, Draco got the pop-up notification first, I believe. Who's just kicked a bin? Oh my gosh, the, the ghost is so annoying. Literally, the ghost is so annoying. Literally, they drive me mad. I hate them. Okay, should we do Draco's birthday then? Da -da -da -da. He's gonna blow out the candles first. Maya is older. Oh my gosh, stop, don't blow them out, don't blow them. Oh, it's too late guys, he's already blown them out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, there was nothing I could do. I couldn't stop it in time. How do you even blow them out with you? With your vampire teeth, if you blew, do you think you would accidentally whistle? Oh, oh I did, I stopped him. Oh, nice, I stopped him. Okay, you guys saying, oh don't add wedding topper, no. Uh, remove that. <laughs> I will do Maya first then. There we go. Add some birthday candles. Maya, please come and blow out the candles. Oh, he's here to see his kid age up. That's cute. Maya got it first. I just wasn't looking. Okay, brilliant. Gotta get her to stop being sad about the dead. Oh, what? You're nice to your dad. Unexpected, but okay. Maya, come on. Come blow out the candles, please. It's your birthday. Please be a kitty. Please be a kitty. Oh my gosh, you just fixed that. You literally just fixed it. What are you thinking? Oh, okay, here she goes. Blowing out the candles. Probably going to be a little bit whistly. And... Oh, are we going to age up? Oh, she sneezed. What's happening, kiddo? What's happening, kiddo? Why aren't you aging up? I had this bug before. Let me try and move it to another place. Okay, add birthday candles. And try blowing them out again. I might have to go for like make a wish or something instead. Why is this pesky human just celebrating this birthday with us? I do not know. Uh, why don't you try... Make a wish. Make a wish to continue the vampire line as heir of this vampire dynasty. Is she gonna age up? <gasps> She's not aging up. Okay, let me put it over here. I've had this before. I had this on my Not So Berry series as well, so I'm not too worried. I did get it to work eventually. Okay. Celebrate. Make a wish. You guys have had this too. You have to do it with MCC. Oh! Boom! Maya aged up! Okay, 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 okay. So we have to give her another... Um, one of her... What you call it, majiggers? Another one of her traits. Okay, so... 
Let me just find the link to do this again. So legacy... Legacy challenge Sims 4. And then, give me a sec, I have to get the link to find out what her next skill is going to be, her next trait is going to be, so... Um, give me a hot sec, it worked! It did work, okay. Uh, traits? Hmm. Does anybody remember how to get the trait picker? Is it under here? Random trait generator! Okay, brilliant. So, you guys might have to help me out with this. Can you remember all of the traits? Look at her face, she looks elderly. Oh my gosh, she actually does. Okay, so. Um, we had evil, we had... What is Claudia's other trait? Um, evil loner snob. Okay, evil loner and snob. And let me make it so you guys can see this, so I can do it with you. Um, uh, do I have like a Chrome sharer? I don't think I do. Did I turn it? Did I do it on this before? Yeah, okay. So evil, loner, and snob. Can you guys see that? You can't really see it. Uh, evil, loner, snob, and then dad is evil, vegetarian snob. They were so made for each other. Evil, vegetarian, and snob. And then the child has the evil trait, so I need another trait. Teen trait, generate. Do I just click generate now? Oh, male, evil, teen trait, loner. So that's gonna be his. Let me generate another child. Let's see if it does male again. Stop doing male, stop always being male. Evil snob. Well, they're both going to be evil snobs by the sounds of it. Which makes sense because both their parents were evil snobs. Adult aspiration master vampire. Okay. Why don't we do then? I'll have to give her the snob trait. Because it's definitely said that. Um, where's snob? Snob. Boom. And then it said master vampire, which I kind of feel like makes sense. Where is master vampire? I can't remember what it's on. Not Vampire Fall Family. Master Vampire, okay. Uh, a Master Vampire wants to become a wise and powerful vampire. So that makes sense. That makes total sense. So there we go. We've got Maya. Um, <laughs> she aged up outside. Wait, wait, I can't even see her. Where's she gone? Ah. <laughs> Okay then, game. Okay. Why are her eyes so freaking big? I do not know. Um, but can we add some more birthday candles and do Draco as well, please? Thank you. And should I give Draco the same um, aspiration? Let me know. Um, Drenny, thank you so much for being here for four months. Spicy Miso, thank you so much for being here for four months as well. And Luke Carlson, thank you so, so much for the bids. Kitty Cat, thank you for the one, two, three, four, five gifted subs. Giving you an absolutely huge heart here. Thank you so, so much. Can we give them some love in the chat, please? Especially if you were just gifted. Okay, we're going to make him a snob as well. I'm going to just give them the same because, like, I feel like it suits them a lot. But he will be doing this separately and on his own once he becomes an adult. And let's have a look at Draco. Why can I, like... <laughs> what does he... What does he even do to them? Like, seriously, what does it even do? Okay, here we go. Cast full edit mode. Let's get in there and let's sort them out right now for their teenage self. I'm gonna pull up a picture of their child self as a little reminder for us. Uh, <laughs> they are funny looking, aren't they? Okay, so 
Here, we'll do, should we do Draco first? Here is child Draco. So, very cute. That is what we are aiming for. The <gasps> oh my gosh, guys, his eyes are broken. <gasps> I might have to reset his eye shape. Because his eyes are definitely broken. Wow! Okay, so, the thing is, I think his eye shape was meant to be the same as Claudia's, which is Obscurus 8. However, I think what's happened is, because it's a custom eye shape, it hasn't... <gasps> it hasn't managed to transfer over! Um, because you can't set that eye shape to men. It's just not available for some super annoying reason. So, um, I don't know why it's female only. Obscurus eight. Let me, let me check something real quick, real quick. Let me go into my mods folder, find that Obscurus eye shape. Um, I might be able to set it for females too, using Sims 4 Studio. Obscurus eyes. Where are the actual eyes? Um, it's not an overlay. It's the actual eyes. Eyelids. N2. It'll be that, won't it? Let me see if I can edit it because it might fix his eyes. What does the thumbnail for it look like? Um... No, it's not that one. Ooh, I've never tried to edit something like this before. I don't know if it's gonna work. But I can't leave his eyes looking like that, can I? Also, her eyes are wrong. Her eyes should be red. Oh, jeez, they're creepy. I love them. Oh, I love it. Wow. Wow. Okay, we'll go for those ones, though. Um, What was I doing? Oh, yeah, I was trying to find these eyes. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Does anybody have these Obscurus eyes and know what's the CCs called? Body presets, lip presets, eye presets. Okay, they're only female. They're 3F. If I set them for male, is it going to work? I don't know. Um, gender flags. Young adult. Age gender flags. I don't know how to change the gender. What number is it? Eight? Eyes? Species? Human? Yeah, I can't take it to be for uh, males as well. Okay, never mind. What we'll do instead is we'll just try and get something that looks similar to this eye and give him those eyes. I do have Korean today. I do have Korean today. Wow. So, it's kind of like, maybe if we start here, and then we just kind of build it from there. It was bigger eyelids though, the actual eyelid section was bigger, wasn't it? Thing is, I don't think there's any eyelids that look like those custom content ones. I will just play with his eye shape, but it was it's definitely broken. <laughs> we take off that as awful CC. Oh man, she's got such a unique eye shape. I'm actually so sad that it didn't cross over to like, um, we might have to give it to Maya instead just to keep the eye shape, but it's the only way to do it. Like it's this eye. I sweeped it a little bit for her, but yeah, that's the eye shape. Oh man.
Yeah, I can't get the exact same eye shape because it's a custom content one. But here is the rest of his face. Okay, let's see what we can do with a little bit of skin details. Right, can you guys remember what skin details he had? It's linking to their vamp vampy forms. Be careful. Okay, let's unlink this then. Boom. Um, let's remind ourselves. Oh, he was so cute. Um, can anyone remember what um, CC I put on them? Oh, you guys said give him the god skin. I don't think it matches being a vampire though. It's too gentle. I'll give him some vampire energy eyes. <laughs> so creepy. So creepy. Oh, the music. Do you guys want some music while I'm in cast? It's because I always switch it off for my main series. There we go. Okay. I feel like we gave them this skin. I feel like he had this skin. But with freckles. He had go pause me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Agree, agree, agree. Hard agree, hard agree. Okay. And then... Ooh, they don't fit on his eyes at all, do they? Okay, let's go for those ones instead. He is fair-haired, so maybe he should have fair lashes. Okay. And then he had freckles. The, um, the boy had freckles, didn't he? So... Freckles. I still think like Draco could be good looking. Her form is linked. Ah. Oh. Okay. I see what you mean now. Just trying to find the same freckles as he had before, because I don't feel like any of these. These ones ain't it. Maybe it was just those ones. Just a light freckling, you know? He looks really scary. He is a vampire. He's meant to look a little bit spooky, you know? Just a little bit. Just a tad spook. Um, a bit of contouring. And then... I f oh, th he ha his nose is tiny though. Oh, why is his nose so small? That's the, that's the overlay he had on his nose as a kid. Oh no, actually, I don't think it is. I don't think it is. I think I added that separately. I think what I did was... Um, his nose is so small. Like, how can my man even breathe? If, he'll be breathing like me, like... <laughs> yeah, I added it like this. I remember now. So he had that instead. He's literally got the tiniest nose I've ever seen on a man. I, th I feel like he needs a smirk. Because he's evil, let's face it, so I'm going to make him a bit smirky. Um, and then... I'm actually feeling like... Let me just remind myself again. Okay. I think he had... He had different eyes. I could give him these eyes. They are my favourite eyes, though. Um, did he have these eyes? Yeah, I think he had eyes more like this. He doesn't have much like of a strong jaw, does he? He's got a very gentle jaw. He's gentle jawed. Yeah, I think he had that eye. I'll give him his flex and stuff as well. He doesn't need to breathe. He's a vampire. That is actually genuinely very true. So well done. Well done! Okay, let's give him some flex. I think his creepiness has massively increased now that he's an adult. Like, I feel like he's genuinely very creepy now. <laughs> he wasn't so much as a kid, but it's all just come out now he's in adult form. I want to give him like a more strong jaw, but I won't. Okay. He does have blonde hair, so he's gonna have fairly fair brows. Maybe more like this vein. 
He reminds me of Voldemort. That's a compliment. Oh, like as in Tom Riddle vibes. I can see that. I can see that. Slightly bloodstained lips. Would you like a bloodstained lip? I don't really like him. He's got a really thick- That's what it is! He's got a thick neck, but he's got narrow shoulders. Also, what is this rig out he's aged up in? I do not know. Yeah, he's got a thick neck and narrow shoulders. Why is your neck so thick? Should I thin his neck out a little bit? Because, I mean, that is just a bit ridiculous, isn't it? His neck was the same size as his, um, as his head! He's got a thick neck. You could always, like, his shoulders will go bigger when he's an adult anyway, so I don't really need to worry too much about those. Um... I like to be adding a bit of lining to my boys. Maybe not that much though. <laughs> thick neck, baby! Yes, make it less thick. Okay, I'll thin him out a bit. He looks a bit more dignified with a thinner neck as well, which I think is like the vibe he had before. He's aged up a bit of a low key wreck, let's face it. Okay. I can hear Ali going, <laughs> Okay, and then let's have a nosy of some hair for him. So remind me again. Okay, he had that hair. Um, What hair should we give him? He's just rogued out on me so hard. He's gone so rogue. So rogue. Maybe I should do his neck a bit thicker. Maybe here. Give him a bigger nose. His nose is tiny. There. That's better. It was just a very fine nose for a guy, wasn't it? Maybe thicker eyebrows. I, I feel like I downloaded a mod that let me thicken eyebrows, but I can't remember how to make it work. I can never get it to work. They just go in and out. They don't actually get bigger and smaller. Oh, there we go. That's a bit better. He is very feminine looking. Posture check, thank you. He's definitely quite a feminine looking dude. But I think that's like, I don't mind that. It makes him more dangerous because he looks less like scary. Um, but Claire babes, yes, a lost cause. No, don't say that yet. Peach Squad, thank you so much for the bids. Kitty Cat, thank you so much for the 200 bids. Aram Lily, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peachies, Miss Duck. Claudia's form will link so everything's copied over now. Oh no, probably link, but better to link Draco's form. Oh, that's a good point. There we go. So you don't have to make changes for both. That's actually a really good point. Okay. Um, I can't hydrate. I told you guys I finished. Um, I kind of like that he's so, like, like gentle looking, even though he's really dangerous. I actually think that that is good, because people will never guess it. They'll never see it coming until he's eaten them, you know? Okay, I wanted to give him the same hair as he had as a kid, because I really liked that hair. However, I gotta say, I just don't know which one it is. I do not know which one it is. We could go for longer hair, like, interview with the vampire vibes. That's kind of a vibe. Please, the shoulders aren't real. What do you mean? I can broaden his shoulders out a little bit. A lot of you guys are complaining about his shoulders. Do you guys like the longer hair? Maybe move his mouth down a bit. Is his mouth too high? That hair's awesome. Yeah, I think that. I think his long hair is good. And we can get it even longer as he gets older. Okay, I want to keep him in vampire clothes. This is the thing. Um... What was his color? His color was green, wasn't it? Are the vampire clothes a bit dead or are they okay? 
This one's okay. Oh, it's a bit... I don't know, it's not very dark, is it? He is so freaking cute, yeah. I would date him. <laughs> I'm glad you like him. He's definitely not how I visually envisioned him. Why does this one like have giraffe spots on it? Um, but I could, I could, he could grow on me. I don't like any of those outfits, I'm sorry. I wanted the first generations to stay like very old school looking um, and we'll have more modern vampires over time but at least initially I wanted them to look really old school so like eventually I do want to have like um, you know vampires wearing like a little bit more modern clothes but I just don't feel like we're there yet I want my first generation to look really vampire -y. This is the only one I can stand. I'm sorry, I hate all the others. So I'm gonna make him look like this. I know it's not green, but there's no nice green outfits. I'm sorry, there just isn't. I want him to stay looking vampy. I feel like in the long term, if we give him facial hair, it's gonna help define his jaw a little bit more. But he's too young right now. I don't really want to give him it if he's a bit too young. Yeah, they're teenagers now. I... Uh, uh. I do want to do that to his jaw though. Just give it like, I have a problem with, with my Sims face has been really squishy. Yeah, I'm gonna lengthen his jaw a bit. It's what he deserves. And then his cheeks, I might add a little bit of, just a little bit of like stronger cheek vibes. There, I think he's a little bit more proportional now. Sliced back hair. So what, like, all swept back? Like, um... Like that? That- that looks really good. That is very Draco Malfoy! Wow! If I did that, I'd probably change his brows to more this shade. Man, I can't find the exact right shade of eyebrow for this boy, I swear. Maybe... Maybe like that. Okay, I'm gonna do a poll. Hair for Draco. Long hair, it's gone cup, sorry. Or um, this hair I'm gonna call um, backwards hair. Which one? Let me know. I like this because it's peak Draco Malfoy. <laughs> and that's kind of what we wanted to do, wasn't it? Okay, I'm just gonna check out his dark form for a second. Unlink it and make his dark form scarier looking um because that's how we roll that is what we like to do so creepy dark form hmm can i go creepier still you sound very creepy hopefully that won't change his other form Yeah, okay. I, wa I want really creepy dark forms. That's what we live for. Oh, it's only showing up around his eyes, lol. Oh, I wanted him to have, like, the brow. I'll just give him that instead. Yes, creepy vampire. Oh, no, that was too much. Cheeks. Maybe try a lighter blonde. Do you guys like the backwards hair? Okay. I like the backwards hair because he looks like Draco Malfoy. And that's what we're going for. That is what we're going for. Okay, I like the idea that when he feeds, it, he becomes vascular. I think that's really cool. Yes! Blood dripping down his mouth when he feeds as well. <gasps> oh my gosh, yes. And Teefees, we're going to go for these Maho creation ones again. 
creepy, right? So creepy. Love that for him. Okay, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. You guys are saying try a different hair shade. Lighter still. What did he look like as a kid? Hmm, it's kind of similar. Oh, no, 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 no. Maybe like that. So it's less yellow. This is yellow. This is like cooler tones. More ash. Yeah, I think that looks better. Oh, sorry. Let me catch up in the chat for a moment. We've got uh, Game of Love Lexi. Thank you so much for um, gifting a sub there. We've got New York Brookie. Thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Peach Squad. Please welcome New York Brookie into the chat. We've got Toaster Brains. Thank you so much for gifting a sub there. Welcome to the Squad New Peachy. We've got Thermal Hades with the uh, with the bits there as well. And then the Resolver. Hello. How are you doing, babes? Please can we get some love in the chat for the Resolver for the one, two, three, four, five gifted subs there. Thank you so, so much for giving the community some love. And we got Ace Marin, who's been here for four months. Happy four months, PG Queen. Loving the series. My other favorite is Cozy Minecraft Vibes. Hopefully you'll play it again soon. Yes, definitely. Um, okay, so Draco is hot, both Dracos. I, I think he looks miles better now. He needed some tweaks, but hey, I am not above tweaking my Sims if it results in a uh, homeboy looking all cute like this. So there we go. That's his dark form. I'm going to nip back to this form so we can change the hair on this one as well. Because I agree with you guys. I just think that... This hair color's better. Not that one. God, no. That one. Okay. Brill, 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 brill. Um, I'm going to copy and paste his outfit across to most of his other outfits. So I'll do that in game. Let's go ahead and check out Maya. Does she need a little bit? Oh my ah. gosh. The CC baseball butt just threw up into the air and pow, straight into her face. She do be looking like a fish though. She do be looking like a fish. The Resolver, thank you so much Mini, for seven months. I can't believe it's been seven months here with you all. I'm so happy to be here. Sorry if missed a few recently. Work has been really busy, but I'm so glad to catch up with you today. Don't worry at all. I hope work's going okay. Ace Marin also. I caught your four months. I did, I did, I did. Resolver, I hope work's going okay. Okay, this girl, bless her, is the biggest wreck I think I've ever seen. Ever. We're going to have to do some serious tweaking. Her eyes, I think we can all agree, are a complete wreck. So, I'm actually going to give her a mother's eyes. Was that the mo Yeah, a bit bigger. I'm going to give her her mother's eyes. Um, because the eyes that she had were... I don't know, the eyes of an alien? They just weren't human at all, in any way, shape, or form. They <laughs> what? Where is the chin game? Where is the chin gone? That is the weakest chin game I have ever seen, ever. Ever, ever, ever. I want to fix the whole side profile of her face. I'm not even going to lie. I like her lip shape. So, you know. We've got that going for us, which is nice. She needed some quite serious changes. Even then, I still think her face shape's a bit weird. The chin just did not show up for the birthday party, did it? The chin was just like, I ain't aging up today. I'm going to stay as your child form. Oh my gosh, what have I just done to her? Why is she just so desperate looking? What? There's just nothing going on here. There we go. Claire say fish goil. She was pure fish goil. Is that any better? Does she look any better now? Does that look better? Move the eyes and the brows up. But aren't your eyes usually in line with your ears? I don't know, jeez. She looks so meek and shy. She really does. I can't decide. There's something about her chin I still don't like.
This is hilarious. Anything you do will make it look better. Chin left the building. Oh my gosh. Let's remind ourselves of how she looked, um, you know, in better days. Like, she was such a feisty looking kid. <laughs> what? What even happened? What even happened? Okay. Right. Oh, I'm just removing my own border over and over again. Right. Let's try. Let's try and fix this. Okay. Let's just bang some, whip some skin details on real quick. I think she's potentially using the same ones as him. So let's see if we can try and get her on a better footing. Okay. I will save her guys. Don't worry, Claire is here to save the day. One sim at a time. One CC nightmare at a time. I'm here. I will I will have your back and I will have theirs. We will get her looking cute. Don't worry, your little heads. I will fix her. Like Coldplay. Only less depresso. We'll get her there, guys. We'll get her there. CC can save everyone. Help my eyes. <laughs> okay. She got a flush on her cheeks from all that killing. Gives her a nice little blush. Good little uh, technique there. Get that one in. Um, get that one in Cosmopolitan. For a fresh look on your cheeks, be sure to drink the blood of your enemies once per day. She took that advice and she ran with it. that one for her and then big ass eyelashes you know it you know it she gonna be cute guys don't worry i got this i got this i was born for this this is what i do best okay this right here is what i do best this is the reason i downloaded this game sorting out disasters one disaster at a time And I want her to look a little bit more feisty. I want her to look more feisty. These are some new eyebrows I got. Um, I'm gonna, these are the Gopols Me G18. I think they're currently Patreon only, but um, I do have them on Patreon. I think they look pretty good on the sim. Now we had black hair on her as a kid, didn't we? Um, I'm worried that she's gonna end up looking like a carbon copy of her mother. She has more color to her than her mother. Her mother was icy pale, so she's already kind of winning a bit. But yeah, I'm a bit worried how much she's just going to look like a copy. So any advice on how we can make her look a little bit different? We did decide to go for black hair on her, but I'm wondering whether that was an error now. Sorry. Going back to that again. That old chestnut. Yeah, she's gonna look just like her mum. I mean, a lot of girls do look very similar to their mums, I guess. It's not like... It's not the end of the world, but... Sorry, I'm just going through every red eye option to see which looks best on her. That's her brother's. She had different eyes to her brother's before. Hmm. Hmm. They do be looking evil though. So you guys sent add purple streaks to her hair. It's easier said than done though, because if we decide on a style that we like and it doesn't actually have um, purple streaks, that's going to make things really difficult. Sorry, I'm leaning on my uh, old favorites for my eyes, I'm afraid. The old trustworthy ones. That's some more flex to them. Well, hi there, Darcy. Oh, he's off to his corner. Okay. 
I started talking to the pets like Mickey Mouse. You remember when I did the stream with um, uh, Among Us and we were all like pretending to be each other? And when they were doing my voice, they just started doing Disney. Uh, they just sound like Mickey Mouse. That's what I've started doing now. So I'm like, well, hi there, Lexi. What are you up to, darling? And I'm like, why do I sound like Southern Mickey Mouse? Like, what am I doing? Um, okay. See, anybody else do that? <laughs> Anybody else do that or is it just me? Let me know. Well, hi there, Darcy. Ooh, that's cute. Just a little bit. Just a touch. Just a touch. She's only just become a teenager. So I don't need to like lather her in makeup. But giving her a bit of a distinctive look is kind of a vibe. And I need to make her look a little bit different to Claudia. Eagle, yeah, but I'm I'm not going super modern yet. That's gonna be in a couple of generations time For now, they're still meant to have this like slightly uh, old-fashioned look because they have been raised by Claudia and they've had Basically zero contact with humans other than a butler who is dressed up as an old-school style butler so like I Don't feel like they would have that much human vibes about them. Yeah. It's going to be later gens when they start to get that energy about them. She looks different enough. Yeah, I think she's getting there. I think she's getting there. Could go back to a bob style as well. That's also a good idea. Let's see what she suits once we get her in there. Once we take a closer look at her. Trying to see which lips look bloodstained, but also cool. Wasn't her colour purple? It was. Her colour was purple. Which lipsticks look like it's got dried blood stuck to it? That kind of works. That looks like a blood flush. Okay. Um, her. Okay, so she, as a kid, she had this hair. So she was starting to get very long hair. Claudia's hair looks like this. Claudia wears a heart and gloves and the whole rig out the whole time. Oh, she's a lot taller. Look how tall they both are. She's not as tall as Draco, but she is a lot taller. Okay, that's quite cool. So that's already a big difference. We could go back to her like Wednesday Adams style. I mean, that looks very cool. That is a whole vibe. I have quite a few of these kind of hairs. I got this one too. Don't know if you heard, just heard Darcy sneeze three times in a row there, but he did. This one as well. Oh, Baba, why are you sneezing so much for? Hello, little baby. Um, I have this one, which I can put like the little hair clips in. Um, like this. I did like the whole Wednesday Adams vibe that she was putting about though. It's just iconic, really. So she can have like this. She looks very creepy, I love it. She does look very creepy. Oh, she needs her vampire teethies, doesn't she? There we go. These are still tied for the moment. Um, I could give her a big, huge plot. Oh, that looks kind of a bit weird on top. Did I download some new hairs recently? Oh, I've got these ones. Oh, it's a quite a lot of forehead. But I could do this. Okay, I know you're thinking, wow, Claire. That's a lot of forehead on my girl. But, 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 but. Remember she had a fringe as a kid. Did she have a fringe as a kid? Or am I hallucinating that? I feel like she had this fringe. We could bring the fringe back. She kind of looks very wild, though. I don't know if that's all just a bit too wild. Hmm, I think it's a bit wild. I think she'd have more like, if she was gonna have like long hair, it would be a bit more like sleek like this. You know, she's a vampire. She's not a werewolf. Hmm. Ooh, wait a minute. Oh, hello! What do you guys think of that? Maybe I'll give you guys some options. Maybe we'll finish the rest of her. So let me just give her some clothes. 
Um, I'll finish the... Ooh. Oh my gosh, it's so much better for the girls. Oh, she was meant to be pink, though. Oh no, she's meant to be purple. I hate that. That's got a bit of purple on it. It's a bit blue, but... Oh, we could go that. No, we'll go that. Perfect. Okay. Um, let me do a few different options. So we can go for this. Or we can go for this, but with a fringe. Oof, I might have to eat before my Korean. I'm really hungry. Like so. It's a bit annoying for me that the fringe doesn't go to the other side. So that, that with a fringe. Or let's go real short. Um, oh, one minute. I just want to show you guys this new hair as well because I've not used this yet. Like so. Eh, I don't feel like it's enough for her. Um, okay, I have this one. And then I feel like I can add the front of the hair a different colour. Ah, see, I feel like that's too modern though. I don't like what I'm doing. I can't see it anyway. Nah, not that. Ignore that hair. <laughs> a bob would be like this. That looks really nice on her as well, but I don't know if she looks a bit too grown up. Okay, let me, um... She does look a bit grown up with the short hair. I'm gonna do a poll. So, her... Long, long, and fringe, or bobbleroo. Boom. Okay, it's a reminder. Bobbleroo. Long with fringe. And long, no fringe. <laughs> um, I might give her some gloves while, while you guys vote. Where are those cool gloves that her mum's got? Yes, I love those gloves. Yes, purple. Her colour is purple! Looking pretty cool, right? She- oh my gosh, thank god we saw her face out. What did it give us? What trash did it give us? She does look a lot like the mom. I will admit that. You guys are thinking long, no fringe. Okay. I'll give you guys till it runs out, but I feel like this hair has won it. These are the other two options. Don't forget, don't forget. She does look cute with the bob as well. I will say that. Okay. I'm gonna... You guys voted for this, so I'll knock off those other two. Now we're gonna unlink the forms and check out her vampy form. Okay, so we're gonna, again, just go maximum creeps with this because, uh... Vampires should be creepy, okay? They just should. I, I would go more creepy if I could, but it doesn't let me add them. Yeah, we're gonna make her look spook. I like the veins coming out. I feel like that's a really cool touch. I'm really glad they added that. Is it in Buffy where when they go vampire, they go like really um, like vascular? Because that's what I really like. This is making a chin look small, but we're not going down that road again. Yeah, vampire vibes. Okay, now eyes. We will switch her eyes out when she's vampire to the old, ooh, creepy. Where is the old black one? And it might need to get rid of this so I can see it. Yes, like that. Oh, yes, creepy. Creepy vampire form. Ace Marin, thank you so much for doing for four months. Happy four months, Queen's Pinchy Queen. Loving this series. We also the resolve. Oh, you with F7 months. Thank you so, so much. Mini Moo, thank you so much for doing for six months. I love you and have all of your merch. I follow you on TikTok and Twitter and everything social media related. Keep going, you're amazing. Mini Moo, thank you so much. That's so lovely. And Chloe and B, and also Kabbalara, thank both of you for subscribing with your Twitch Prime. Welcome to the Peaches. <gasps> Taz is here. Can we get some love in the chat for Taz, please? Taz, you are here just in time to see my vampire. Should I switch the shader off for a sec so you guys can see? Oh, wow. 
You can see how much saturation I put on. <laughs> uh, but here is our little vampire children. They're all aged up into adults now. This is Maya, uh, being a creepy teenager. That's her vampire form. And this is her regular form. And then here is Draco. Where did we get the inspiration for him? I will never know. Lol. And then this is his uh, vampire form. Creepy! Creepy creepy! I feel like his eyes are too close together. Is that better or have I just made him worse? Let me ch I can't- I can't tell when he's in vampire form. His eyes are really big. I wonder if I should make them a bit smaller. Because they're gonna get smaller when he becomes an adult? Maybe it's the middle bit's too big. His eyes are huge. I don't know. I don't love Draco. I don't love his form very much, but... He was such a cute kid as well! It just shows you that cute kids don't necessarily end up as cute adults, doesn't it? Oh my gosh, no. I don't like- whatever I've just done there, I don't like. Claire shade is off. I know, I'll put my card again. Tint doesn't really work in cast. So look, in cast usually, if I'm like taking screenshots or whatever, I actually turn off tint because that looks way better than that. Like that just looks stupid, but it looks better in game. So for cast, you don't really want tint on. So that, and then that's the difference. He looks like a he looks like Scar from The Lion King. <laughs> I I was so like worried about Maya being um air because I thought we should make um. Draco the air, but now I'm really happy that Maya's um, the air instead. <laughs> I'm so glad that Maya's the air instead. Okay, we will allow him to live with us while he's a teenager. Oh. After that, we're gonna kick him out of the house. And he can go repopulate the vampire world as well, but in his own way. We are like lions, we kick them out. We kick them out of the tribe. Kick them out and send them off into the wild to, uh... <laughs> to, uh, repopulate the world. He is scary. He is. It's girls only. Boy smelly. Boy smelly. Irish B. Uh, B. Tresson. Thank you so much for the bits there. Thank you for the support. And it's a commit. Welcome to the Peaches. Thank you so much for subscribing. We've got 161 new Peaches today, which is absolutely amazing. He looks like Chef's Kiss, and I have a girl crush on her. I have a girl crush on Maya, but not so much on Draco, it has to be said. Oh. Oh. And here is how they look out in the wild. So much better than before. So much better. They definitely be looking a lot more vampire now. And on that note, I am actually gonna go. His, his days are numbered until the big years. Exactly. On that note, I'm actually gonna end the stream because I've got my Korean lesson in 20 minutes time. Also, I'm so hungry. I'm gonna have to get a snack before my Korean lesson as well so i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video i'm just gonna have a quick nosy at who we got streaming i didn't play rust uh, but a lot of you guys did vote for rust so i think instead we will raid somebody playing rust so please 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 let me know who you would like to raid i'm gonna do a quick little i've, I've just typed in poll uh, instead of poll with two l's let me know who you would like me to raid we did koji last time and we've raided him the past two times so i'm not gonna put koji's name on there we still do love for koji though don't worry We've got Frey, we've got G, we've got Josh Elam, um, we've got Lexi. Those are all the people that are currently playing Rust that I would have played Rust with if we'd have played Rust today. So let me know which one of these you got these guys you would like me to raid. Um, yep, G's, G's playing too epic. G, yeah, I did. Um, let me know which one of them you would like me to raid. You can also have a little bit of a nosy at uh, um, what Rust looks like in case you guys were wondering. Um, I think it's kind of crazy. Um, I think it's it's like a bit of a roleplay vibe to it as well. So let me know which one of those you guys uh, would like me to raid. It's looking like a Lexi raid. Okay, raid Lexi Marie X. Boom. Cool. Uh, 
Are we ready? Yeah, okay. Okay, as many of you guys as possible, please come and give Lexi all the love. She's absolutely wonderful and she's drop dead gorgeous and we all have a massive, massive Lexi based crush. So go and feed it with a Lexi raid. Thank you guys so much for joining me in today's video. I hope you've had as uh, much fun as I have. If you have uh, joined this late and you want to catch the beginning of the video, it's all going to be uploaded on YouTube. And I will see you guys in another stream or video. Have a beautiful evening. Not so berry is going to be going up as soon as I finish this, okay? So check on Clash Yvonne to watch that and I'll see you guys there. Bye!